Hey guys, Professor Bill, Comic Book University, Lex Luthor, Porky Pig. All right, I'm really surprised at how good this one was. All right, this is this is easily have to be my second favorite one. This was extremely funny, easy to follow along, and um, very rewarding at the end in on multiple fronts. All right, uh, gotta find who wrote and okay, there we go. So this particular one is called Employee of the Month. Writer, Mark Russell. Penciler, Brad Walker. Inker, Andrew Hennessy. Colorist, Andrew Dollhouse. And letterers, ALW's Troy and D -D -D Dave. <laughs> the cover artist is uh, Ben Oliver. And variant cover artist, Mech Ray. First off, I do want to point out that um, we should probably enjoy this book while we can before all of a sudden uh, stuttering is something that we're going to, you know, making fun of, you know, imitating Porky Pig is going to be something that's considered rude. Like, are, I'm offended that you're making fun of people who have cognitive disassociations. Like, dude, it's, it's literally just, come on, man. It's, it's Porky Pig. Anyhow, um, yeah, this was, this was good. His Porky Pig's rise and fall, Petunia the pig is in it. <laughs> uh, Lex Luthor, is in this uh, a character who's much like Elizabeth Warren is in it and man what an accurate representation like oh my god <laughs> the, the what comes back at her is horrible and obviously it's a it's a play on it but man it's not wrong it's really not wrong the idea that it's it's political porn what happens in the 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 senate house you know saying those senate hearings Wow. Oh my God. I, I never thought of it that way. <laughs> this is genius. So this whole, like I said, the whole book from beginning to end, there's a really great story here. Don't expect any violence or killing people or anything like that. You're going to find out who's been stealing sandwiches from the company uh, fridge. You're going to find out different ways to try and discover who the culprit is. Um, this is absolutely amazing. It's amazing. Um, yeah, I, I, I literally, I can't find a single part of this comic book that I just didn't like. Uh, the second story was, was good. It just wasn't like the first one. <laughs> the, oh my God, this first story was just utterly amazing. I need to write stories like that. That's all I'm saying. That was just too hysterical. So I cannot recommend this one enough. So good. Uh, the next one, Lex's uh, Next Appointment. Uh, Jim Fanning's the writer. John Lauder is the penciler. Paul J. Lopez inks. Colorist Wes Abbott and uh, uh, letter. Okay, so I just kind of skipped over stuff. Sorry, my bad. Anyway, those people are involved in this comic book. So honestly, check this out. This was really fun, okay? The Sylvester Tweedy one, I have to give that above this one with uh, with Black Cat. That sh or, sh Black Cat with Catwoman. That should have actually said, I'm trying to get everything together, Black Canary and Catwoman, okay? And Sylvester and Tweedy. That should have had Black Canary in there also on the title. But whatever, it is what it is. This one right here, oof, oof for its own reasons, just as good. Just as good. All right, guys, that's going to be it for me. Professor Bell, Comic Book University. Class dismissed.